we introduced this concept of a metamaterial. Now, an ordinary material, it responds to an electric field, say, um, according to how the atoms and molecules polarize. And its average response over many millions of molecules gives the electrical response of glass or water or whatever common material you're thinking of. But in a metamaterial, the atoms and molecules are replaced by slightly larger elements which have a physical structure. They might be tiny metallic rings, for example, or holes in the structure, the very, very simplest form. And in these metamaterials, these uh, little units, which are bigger than atoms and molecules, but nevertheless smaller than the wavelength, they act like rather big atoms and molecules. And you, by designing their structure, you can design the properties of these metamaterials.